Hey everyone, my name is Tom, or you can call me Rex. Um, I'm here to tell you a little bit about wrestling and football, my two main passions. And well, from well this day forward I suppose, well, not yet, maybe in a bit, I'm going to start giving you wrestling information and football information. As you can see, Tottenham fan. So yeah, all you football fans out there that want to know about football results, or want to ask me questions about anything, or Tottenham fans want to ask me questions about stuff I could know, or I'll try my best to answer your questions to the best of my ability. And yeah, Arsenal fans, I will still answer your questions. So don't worry about that. Uh, for wrestling, I, I'm a mad wrestling fan. 20, I'm 22 years old. I've been watching wrestling most of my life, or all of my life probably. And my favourite of all time is The Nature Boy, Ric Flair. Uh, then of the Attitude Era, it was The Rock. And nowadays it's John Cena. But any questions you want to ask me about wrestling, go for it. Fire away, I'll answer to the best I can. Or rumours you want to know about and stuff like that uh yeah so what i'm gonna probably do is is like on saturdays you got your football sundays you got your football so what i'll do is you know once a week do a football video for your football fans and then once a week do a wrestling video for the wrestling fans so it's me having to sit here and do both and you wrestling fans having to hear about me talking about football and the, the football fans having to sit here and hear me talk about wrestling so yeah, I'll just do the two videos, and we'll get them done. But for this one, I'll chuck it all into one, because this is my first video, and hey. So if you think about it, let's start with the football first of all. Uh, Tottenham held old Manchester United to a draw, still fifth in the league, and they're still fighting for Champions League spot over Chelsea, and Chelsea's form have... <sighs> I don't know what's going on with Chelsea this season, but I reckon they really need to get rid of Carlo Angelotti. And you've got Man City. I reckon, personally, Man City are going to win the title this season. Because you've got Roberto Mancini is an immense manager. And I don't know how they do it, but the money they've got, they're bringing in players that are beyond... It's just crazy. You know, beyond capability and chucking them all into one team, you've just got forced to be reckoned with. Uh, then you got Arsenal. I don't know, you know, they're chucking away points when points are needed, really. Um, Liverpool, they're out. Liverpool are going to finish in the bottom half of the table, I reckon, unless Ken Dalglish, good old Kenny, could do something for Liverpool. But Tottenham have recently just signed Stephen Pienaar. We're still trying to get Beckham. So we'll see how that goes. And yeah. So also, now, you know, ask football updates, all I can hear about. And let's go on to wrestling and tell you a little bit. <clears throat> We've got a Royal Rumble coming up, of course, the next big pay per view. It's a, for all you who didn't know, it's a 40-man Royal Rumble. It was set on Raw because they got too many superstars. And Mr. McMahon wants to give them all a spot doing something. So he's chucked them all into a 40-man Royal Rumble. And I want your views on who you think is going to win it. Because to me, it's an open Rumble. I reckon... I don't know. Because you've got... People being pushed. I reckon Del Rio will be pushed this this year. Well, Dolph Ziggler is getting a push. Miz is being pushed. Uh, I reckon John Morrison should get a push. Um, yeah, and this could be a very entertaining year for young talent. But we just need to see how, where it goes, really. Because you don't want you got all these superstars you. You know, you need to do something with them when they're going to take a walk to TNA. That's what all they've done. All these superstars that ain't getting spots there were thinking, well, fine then, we're just going to go. So, but I'm not Mr. McMahon, I don't know. But, 
for all those who are going to ask me who I think will win the Rumble, I'm going to answer honestly, I don't know. Because you've got Punk with the new Nexus behind him, Barrett with the old Nexus, and now Ezekiel Jackson behind him. The Big Show, he's on quite a run. Cena, of course. Um, then you got returning of Chris Jericho, possible return of Triple H. Um, this this could be a rumble. This this is this is gonna be this is history. First forty man Raw Rumble, yeah. Whatever we're gonna see is gonna be history, and I will talk to you about this history that we're all gonna witness. So don't worry. But yeah, hopefully someone decent will win. Hopefully, I know you're gonna hate me, but Cena. Yes, 22 years old and a Cena fan. No, I'm not gay. <laughs> I'm just one of those many, many, many fans that have supported him since day one. I was sat there watching SmackDown when his music, when Kurt Angle was running in his mouth. Is there anyone out there who can find me? And he comes out and Kurt Angle goes, What have you got that I ain't got? And Cena just looked at him straight like, Ruthless aggression. Whack. And the whole world was like, Oh, who is this guy? Man, he's crazy. And then at his first pay-per-view, he beats Chris Jericho. And I said, I just thought this kid is immense. So yeah, I've liked him since day one. And I'm not one of those people that turn on their superstar when they're bad or good. If I like someone, I'll stick by them from the day I've started supporting them. Uh, so yeah, uh, it's me, Tom, or Rex, or whatever you want to call me. But yeah, uh, get in, send me messages, subscribe to me. I'll keep you all posted on wrestling and football news with different videos and any questions you want to ask me personally just ask away you know comment or send me a message and also before I go rated J rated J is a good close friend of mine I'm not going to say his name because he, he you know that's his job to do but check out rated J he's a mad wrestling fan he probably won't bring you football news because he's not a football fan. So that's me for that. But he knows more about wrestling than I do. So check him out as well. Because he will bring you the news that you need to know. So it's me. Glad to meet you all. Uh, this is my first video on you know, YouTube. So it's quite good. Hope you all like it. And if you don't like it, um, well, nothing I can do really, is there? So yeah. Peace out, y'all.